What's up, Sleep Black? It's your boy. He was gamer. And we're back with some more. Code Vein. Last time we were playing. We ran into a chick. You know, we found the blood spring. Then we ran into a chick. Chick attacked us. We were going to kill the chick. Or Yakumo was going to kill the chick. But then it turned out the chick had a kid with her. So we gave her one of the blood crystals we had. They left. Lewis was like, we got to go after her. You know that, right? And Yakumo was like, yeah, yeah, let's go. All right, so now me and Yakumo trudging through the fucking mud to find this bitch. All right, because I really fucking like Yakumo, all right? How hard he hits? Fucking great. I gotta kill a few more shit before I max all this shit here out. Um, we got to this area, which I was saying, this clearly looks like it's leading to a boss area. This long ass hallway. And as I was saying that, the, the girl started saying, please don't. And there's some male boys. I'm gonna make it pick quick and painless. And then, I think it was Yakumo, not, uh, he was like, we got to get over there. And I was like, all right, end it here. And now we're going to start this boss shit, you know? Hold on. I'm on my way. And that's what this is. If this is leading towards some boss shit, you know? All right, I think that's the last 80%. Yep. Fire. And I'm, I'm not really planning on doing it the first time. Wait, is that the hunter? It is. Damn it. Where'd he run off to? These ashes are the boys. Something's coming. Ah, man. That looks annoying. Wait, is this the dancer? There's apparently there's a dancing enemy here. I wonder if it's just her. That looks like a foot. And this water isn't nearly deep enough. That's a spear. It is her. Alright. First things first. Yeah. Great range. Great, great range. No. Hey, hey, hey. All right, I'm dead. Nigga, she slowed me. Like, fiercely slowed me. Ah, uh, yeah, annoying. But easy. Actually, she's really easy. No. Ah, oh, shit. Besides being fucking slowed, if it wasn't for that slow shit, oh man. I can't run. Bitch. Okay, this slow shit, this slow shit's annoying. There we go. There we go. There we go. She's gonna 
fucking going second phase. Use this chance to heal up. Oh! Okay. Well. Yeah. Yeah. But I can beat her. I don't know why that first boss was so fucking difficult. You okay? It's kind of like Rune Factory 4, where, like, the second boss is, like, the hardest boss. And in comparison to him, everybody else is just fucking easy. You know, I don't know what it is with that, but that's that's what it's like. So it's the hunter. I believe he did that as a pity kill, though. So like. Ready for this? Prepare. slow with that shit oh my god oh my god that's fucking annoying real fucking annoying like bruh not difficult just annoying that's that's what it is nope 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 She has a lot of damage though. For real. She has a lot of damage. Oh. Oh. Whee! Ah shit. That was a perfect dodge too. That. That's devastating. I'm not even sure what weapon I should be using with her. So I want to use the weapon that gives me the best evasion. But with her fucking shit, does it even matter how good my evasion is? I don't think it does. I really don't think it does. I could cast haste. And just haste myself instead of doing more damage. I don't even know if, like, the... I wonder. I wonder. I'm, I'm gonna test it. Moving up. I'm glad I died right here, too, because a lot easier to grab this shit. Don't worry about Bring me. it any time. Don't get in the way. Good. We grab it. It's a big help. Get that slow shit? Fucking annoying, but am I still in the bed? Let him go in, let him go in. I need to give myself something. So I can give myself another way to dodge. Stay calm. You'll get tunnel vision if you're too. What I'm going to do? I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna replace this. Ooh. Ooh. Let's go like that. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I'm thinking. If I slow her, like, would it even? Would that even matter? I mean, like, really a lot of micro mansion. It's a lot of micro mansion. Flame. Let's put Venom Trap. Or, ah, oh, I can't use Blazing Roar or Sanguine Roar. Fuck. Those are good, too. I'm gonna go with Venom Trap. Keep poison. So, if I do get the poison status off on her, it's gonna be great. I 
I wonder if I can stack those three or if they cancel each other. I don't know. If I can stack lightning, poison, and slow. Not poison. Lightning, seal, and slow. That's going to be great. Hold on. I'm on my I also got to pay attention to how much blood I have so I can know if I need to care about it. Right here. Right here. Ah, shit. Appreciate it. Seems like lightning's really doing the trick. Grab this. Put this on. to hasten until after she does that water shit. But like, it's my fox, I, I charged into it. I charged into it. If I didn't charge into it, I wouldn't have gotten slowed. So I'm not even gonna blame her on that. I'm not even gonna blame her on that. Don't run too far ahead. Did I grab my uh, health, my blood? I hope I did. We're bogged down here. Yeah, imagine they put enemies right here, man. That would be so fucking annoying. Uh, Time for some uh, back, huh? Kick ass. Alright, so it's two million. I mean, two hundred. Nope. Nope. Fuck you. Get my health back, get my health back, my stamina. Slow shit last, like this lasted a long ass time. Nope, nope, fuck! Nope, 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 nope. No, no, no. Get your bitch ass back down. Sickle, that's what that was? Alright. That ass would be like mud in the water. Took it from her hands. As soon as I saw what she saw, I was like, no! Nope! Give me that shit. She almost just forced herself to become lost. Fucking crazy chick. 
Yeah, man, she wasn't hard, but that slow shit. That slow shit. How many times was that? Three? I think I died six times to a lost D spot. Or the insatiable D spot. I think I died four, three to four times to her. But I don't count the first death, right? Because I knew I was going to die the first time. Because I couldn't, I didn't, I wasn't prepared for that shit. A lot of my effects, I got to set up beforehand. Like, if I do kill a monster or boss. Like, first time, first try, like, uh, Oliver. Mia, I'll be back. That's a real easy boss. Sorry, Sorry but it's time. it's time. You shouldn't you sleep so late, late, you know. I see. So yeah, the hunch is the hunter is Jack. So she was she knew Jack and them. She was working with Jack and them. But like I'm saying, I think Jack killed this nigga out of fucking pity. She's gonna be mad at me. Remember, once you're in there, you're in forever. Are you really sure? Yeah, I'm sure. I want to keep me a sick. I don't know about this one. Alright. JRPG logic, right? Says that kids have to save the world. Right? But, normally, when they say kids, they mean like 12 to 15, 16 year olds, you know? You know, that's normally the kids have to go save the world. Very rarely is it someone that young, that little. You know? It's middle school to high school age is when kids have to go save the world. Never elementary. I mean, there's a few games like um, Mother and Earthbound, same series, but. But very rarely, right? I don't know how old this nigga is, this little kid. Mm. But he looks like at the oldest, he's what, nine? You have a noble spirit, Nikolai. I respect that. Once you're up there, you're up there. Uh, there ain't no coming back. Where is there? Makes me wonder if his own um, becoming lost wasn't due to, you know, hunger. But whatever it is that, you know, he went up there and saw or did. Mm, that's beautiful. I would love to see an ice biome or a snow biome. And it sucks. That she wasn't, she didn't get to see this because she passed the fuck out. She almost turned herself. I think that memory was from the boy. What exactly was going on? A snowy mountain. Is something there? You saw who was there with the kid, right? How do you think those two know each other? What the hell is going on? Well, they know each other, kind of like how you two know each other. Obviously, they were in a group. What is going on? How do they know each other? They were in a group, obviously. Alright. I forgot his name. Lucas? Is that his name? Not Luis. I'm talking about the uh, hunter. Was it Lucas? Luke? The hunter obviously has a group of revenants he's working with. 
All right. And if you're not part of his group, then you're the enemy and you need to get out of his way or die. All right. I'm guessing Nicola and I never got, was it Amy? Mia? I think it's Mia. She was, they were part of his group. Just like that one songstress was probably part of his group. Or is probably part of his group. What they're doing though, and what's on this mountain? Mm -hmm. But I'm telling you, what probably made him start becoming lost was on this mountain. All right. And Luke, Lucas, whatever the fuck his name is, the hunter, Take Nicola, Nicola, back to Mia before she even realized what happened. Because they left while Mia was asleep, so obviously Mia didn't agree to it. Alright. Luke, so Nicola probably told the hunter everything he saw up there. And then was slowly becoming lost due to everything he saw. And he told her, you know, because we're running low on blood. But really, it was because of this shit right here. I'm telling you, I feel it in my guts. And it's just a shame she didn't get to see it. Because she could have tyrants laborious. A double bit axe that glitters in dull gold, even heavier than it appears, one of the very strong can wield it. Effectively, the shiny blade, the hounds are not real gold. But Forge recreated with the birth of a tyrant. Yeah, I have that. That's actually a good, that's a damn good axe. This one's called like the Executioner's or the Butcher's Axe or some shit like that. The Destroyer's Axe. That I thought the uh, Lost Dispot was. The Insatiable Dispot. <laughs> She's losing herself. She needs blood. Right. Then we're going back to base. I could have just gave her some of my blood then and there. You know that, right? I guess, uh, just a, besides touching that shit, right? Nicola was like the only thing she had to hold on to to keep her from going lost. So it didn't help that she grabbed his fucking blood vein. Alright, but... I don't know, man. I'm confused, right? Because, like, I'm trying to understand how the lost works. Is it that until you destroy their heart, they just... Die and are reborn? So if you destroy their heart, they're permanently dead? Or is it that... Mia. Nicola, are you there? I'll be back. Wait, let me go with you. You shouldn't sleep so late, you know? Where... So that's on top of the mountain. I mean, it's obviously in her head, because <laughs> we're not there. Where am I? So she did see some of his memories by touching it. And that's causing her to become lost. I want to keep me as safe. Don't go, Nicola! I want to have what makes them lost, right? Because her folks experience the memories of other people. And they can't deal with it. You know, they're already losing themselves. So experiencing memories of someone else is just confusing. 
It's safer for her because Nicola was, was her little brother, but like. A dream? Barely, nigga. You almost died. Why is she wearing the mask? Was she wearing the mask when we first met her? I don't think so. Fix your strap. That shit bothers me. Yeah, he's gone. He ain't coming back. But that means... She didn't fix her strap. She's gonna go up there too, isn't she? What exactly is going on here anyway? Why does every blood vein we find lead back to the old city ruins? The key to finding the source is there. That's all I can say for certain. Uh, sure. But we've been everywhere we can... Try here. You know the statue of the goddess in the ruins? There's a mechanism inside of it. I see. So that's our ticket. A hey, are you sure you should be up and about? Yeah, it's okay. I feel he has braids in his hair. Sorry for causing you so much trouble. I'm fine now. I hope I'll get a chance to repay you. That information is more than enough. There is a favor I'd like to ask. I'd like you to tell me how to get here. Please, it's... It's really important to me. I'll pay you back, I promise. I'd love to tell you. If I knew. I'm not sure of the path there myself. Other than that, it's sealed off by my asthma. I see. Sorry, I don't mean to make demands of you. It's not impossible, though. We were able to pass through the miasma. <laughs> Thanks to our friend here. If you decide to stay with us, I'm sure we'll find the way to your snowy mountain eventually. Of course, you would need to help us out with our objective first. I'm glad to do whatever you need me to. As long as I end up reaching my destination. We have a deal. Good to have you along. I don't understand this, man. I'm confused. Likewise. Well, great. I guess that's settled then. You are now officially one of our friends. Friends? I'm Yakimo. This brainiac here is Louie. And... Huh? Where'd Murasame and Io get to? I mean, if that's okay. It is. Actually... I don't think we've gotten your name yet. This is Mia. Oh, I'm Mia Karnstein. And I'm good in a fight if you guys ever need the help. Yeah, you sure did a number on Yakumo. Seriously, that really hurts. <laughs> Glad to have you on our side, Mia. You're an asshole.
You're a real asshole, Yakimo. What happened to the arm oh, watching you? Better not try nothing. The act you gave me. It's because I'm a dude, right? And she's a chick. Everyone's stuff is fixed up and ready to go. Oh, you're an angel, Murasame. Sorry we're always piling up the work on you. Well, you'll find the source for sure this time, right? I look forward to hearing your report when you get back. Look at all this stuff. Did you gather it yourself? Oh, you're feeling better. That's great. I was worried about you. That's what he gets. Where are, are these siblings? Age, aren't we? we are gonna be besties, I can tell. Uh, she's like that with everyone. Just smile and nod and it'll be fine. Now, now, those aren't for you, Eo. We wouldn't want you to get hurt. That's right. No need to rush recklessly into battle. There are people waiting for us at home after all. And without them, well, where would we be? Oh, Yakumo looks sad. <laughs> Give me a break. And don't look at me like that. It's no big deal, okay? My friends are important. They're like family to me. My friends were all scattered after the Great Collapse. I don't even know if any of them survived. Oh, I thought Lewis was in that picture, but I guess not. Every time we go somewhere new, I keep an eye out for them. Anyway, I count myself lucky. I went through some really nasty rejections back when I became a revenant. Honestly, I was right on the brink of losing myself. It was my friends that pulled me back, kept me safe. <laughs> Bunch of sentimental fools. Yeah, their shirts didn't render that Keep time. them safe, no matter what happens. I don't have that, That's so when I become lost, oh, I'll screw to me. And now I've got three more sheep to look after. The man's work is never done. So just don't worry about it. Who's the three other sheep? Because it can't be Mia, because she's a fighter. Well, there you you're in awfully high spirits. What do you mean? Normally, you've got eyes like a dead fish. But now, you actually seem alive for once. I'm just glad you found some friends to cheer you up. Friends? Nigga, I'm just so fucking handsome. It's just... I suppose you're right. Every scene I'm in, I make brighter. Nigga. Look at how much color I add. Like, me is close. So, uh, the amount of color that my presence brings. It looks like everyone has gone to rest. It seems more cheerful here now. The atmosphere has brightened a lot since we first came. You have the strength to overcome any obstacle in your path. A curious individual indeed. Yep. Curious. 
It's even like it's even crazier because technically speaking, like if I'm not mistaken, I I do believe that I might actually be lost. I'm not a revenant. I might actually be a lost. Right? Because it's not like Dark Souls, right? Where you die again, again, again. You give up hope. And then after giving up hope, you become hollow. Like, truly hollow. Right? In this game... When you lose all your memories and you no longer care about dying or your memories, that's when you become lost. Right? And as Yakumo once said, if you have no memories, all you are is a revenant on the outside, but on the inside you're lost. Not only do I not care about dying and it doesn't affect me, I have no memories of my past. I don't know who I am. I don't know who I was. So I really do believe that my character is actually just a revenant shaped loss. Is something the matter? Recently, I've been puzzled. If it is possible, I want to stay with you, just like the others. help to make a difference but it cannot be I am unable to fight so I would only put you in danger I have to continue doing what I must that much I am sure of there's something that confuses me it's a strange sensation that wells up from within me what is it Frustration? It's probably frustration. Alright, because I doubt it's sadness or envy. She wants to help me, right? But she's not physically capable of helping me. Right? So all she can do is do what she can, but the fact that she can't help me in the way she wants... It's frustrating and it can make you feel helpless, you know? I understand completely what she's talking about. I'm not sure. It's a feeling as though something is pushing me. Yep. Frustration. I'm out of coffee. I'm drinking water. <sighs> Speaking of which, did I? I didn't get his blood. All right. <sighs> but it's like. I don't know if there's going to be a point where I can take her out to fight with me. I would love it. I would love it a lot. Oh, that's so much lighter. The an executioner that dwells in the pits. So I was going to name this episode. The lost little brother. Because so I thought it'd be, you know, the little brother became lost and we had to kill him. Kind of like Oliver. But it wasn't. So I might call it, I might call it the lost little brother and the hunter. Alright, because he got a lot of story shit. I really do like this. Got a lot of story shit. What is it? What, what did I give you? Chocolate garlic flakes. The 
I know who likes sake. You don't like sake. You might like sake. There's something I want to get my blood coat. That way I can keep helping you out even if I'm not around, right? It's a symbol of trust. Go on, take it. Hey. Oh, he's Atlas. And she's assassin. All right. All right. Bet. Bet. I'm about to go activate all that. Although, let me see if he wants this toy. I might be the wrong person, but I'm gonna see. Hey, what's up? Hey, it's Booger Rally. Powerful friendships and over the top action. I was mesmerized. There was nothing like it. I collected the cards and toys when I was a kid. I want to watch it again sometime. And there's no way it's still going on now. I wonder, like, since they were in the same spot, the assassin and Atlas. I'm gonna give you these. I'm gonna give you this food. Some humans say revenants hate garlic, so I guess fault. It gets tiring hiking around almost every day. A treat like this is good medicine for me. I'll savor every last bite. So she did like it. What about Saki? I don't know. Who seems like they would like Saki? He likes... He likes action figures and comics. He likes music, probably movies. She likes toolboxes to repair shit. Does he like perfumes and shit? Would he like sake? I'm gonna give you this sake. They don't everything they do either. The fact is, in order to keep surviving in this world without joining the lost, we need their help. Besides, Davis over there is one of the most trustworthy people I know. Go talk to him. He won't lead you astray. I'm grateful to accept this. Yep. Saki wasn't for you. It's probably for her. Food and drinks. Food and drinks. Here, let me... Disturb this. I just... Well, let's look at it. A butterfly made of armor plating treated fabric. It's a protective that looks includes the luncheon and has support gifts. Damn it! Damn it. The whole place is swarming with horrors. horrors. We need to get out of here fast! Wait, wait, wait. Some of our people are injured. Leave them behind. We don't have the numbers to sit around defending the wounded. There's a building surrounded by a moat up ahead. We can take refuge there for a while. It should give us some cover. <laughs> are you kidding me, Yakumo? All of them are gunners? Some of those guns look crazy. Do you want to you stick want to around stick until around everyone, everyone heals? heals? Take, Take a look, look outside, outside Yakumo. It's, it's horror, horror town. town. We need, we to, need look to look for a way out while, while we still, still can. can. And just, just leave our friends behind? behind? I'm not going to do that. I can't. I'd rather, I'd rather die, die here defending them. <laughs> You've completely You've lost, lost it, man. It. I guess I it's guess just us who want to live. See you, Yakumo. I don't know, man. Your friends are assholes. You sure you want to fight them? Well, Ricky in particular. Should we really have stayed? We've made our choices. Anyway, no one can know what tomorrow will bring. Right, Yakumo? 
Yakumo? Yeah. Yeah. Right. Right. I see. So probably blames himself because he's. They stayed because of him. If they left with Ricky. They would have been safe. I feel him. I understand that. I mean, that one dude looked like he was injured and still healing, so he probably wouldn't have made it. Those people, they were my old comrades. We might be able to find out where they are now if we follow their memories. You know, use them as a kind of trail. We stayed with the injured. I guess. In a way, I'm the one who left Riki behind back then. Along with everyone who followed him. In the end, all of us who chose to stay died. Maybe if we had talked it out more, we could have found a way to stick together. Maybe then some of us might have survived. You did the right thing, Yakumo. You died doing it, but you did the right thing. Oh, thanks for saying that. Still, I get it in my head sometimes. I start to wonder, did all those guys who left blame me for their deaths? Well, it's not like I'll find the answer now. No matter how many times I ask. This is pause right there. What I believe it was meant to say is all those who was left behind with him. Do they blame him for their deaths? You know. Not all the people who left with Ricky. Because they'd have to blame Ricky. Hey doll. What you doing doll? This right here is annoying. What is it? Restore Vistage. I gotta go find the second fucking hunter. I don't know where the fuck it would be at. Oh! I have part B. I need one hand sword mastery and dexterity up? No, wait. That has the gifts available. So I don't have... B. I don't have... Okay, I gotta find B. That's all I'm gonna do off camera. Wait, I need Atlas 2 for Assassin? That's crazy. Crazy if you're thinking of helping those guys who got separated, Yakumo. It's suicide! They're our friends, Riki. I won't ignore them. Always digging your heels in. You'll get everyone killed. I'll help you this one time. After this, you're on your own. Alright, we need more context. It was you, wasn't it, Yakumo? You're the one that stopped our trade. Trade? You mean moving things to sell in the black market? Call it what you want, but you're no better than thieves. Riki, we were orphans. You remember what it was like. Nido took everything from us before we even knew we had it, and we were powerless to stop them. How could you steal from someone weaker than you? Always the golden boy, huh? I've never fallen for your insipid act. Fine, then. Let's settle this right here, right now. I'll show you what happens to simpering brats like you who don't know when to quit. I'm telling you, man. Ricky boy, Ricky boy, Ricky boy. Does not seem like a good person. I mean, he's not necessarily wrong. 
Back it off already, would you? Back off? Back off? I don't think so. If I did that, you would have killed me. <laughs> That's why I don't like you. I like Wiki's voice though. <laughs> That's why I don't like you. That's how a cutthroat should sound. Savage, vicious. I like Ricky, does seem like he was a good person. But yeah, trying times, you gotta do trying shit. I don't know if he was just a sore loser or if it went deeper than that. But Ricky had been coming after me ever since we were little kids. The two of us disagreed on absolutely everything. And got into fights damn near every single day. Calling him a good guy would be a stretch, but... Well, yep. at least he was honest with himself. That's something. I'm praying to the Lord that this shit isn't copyrighted. That orchestra shit, I'm hoping that's not copyrighted. I really am, because my nigga... She just likes lounging around. If it is, that's fucking kick in the pants. Very fucking painful kick in the pants. Require some shit. Alright, I'm missing a lot of shit. So, yeah, alright. What's this? Resilient focus, increasing my focus gain by receiving damage. I, mean, I already got that. <laughs> Tormenting blast. Alright, learn, require. Yeah, I'm good. Guard drain rating up. Increase your drain rating when you guard an enemy's attack. Okay. Hmm. Dog fighter. Temporarily increase stay resistance for versus enemy attack. That's it. Foul blood barrier. Press a single use uh, barrier. Around you and your partner, that greatly reduces damage. And that means there's probably some more of his shit. Not just his shit, but Prometheus' shit. Probably not in the uh, Halloween pits. But there's probably more of his shit in Halloween pits. I believe it. Flashing fame. Increased power for the next attack. There's a lot of these. Guard reversal to really enable you to deflect attacks and stack your opponents after guarding. Gotta be two-handed sword though, cause I have an axe. I don't have enough. Ah, I don't have enough. This is firm stand. Receiving fatal damage when your HP is over a certain amount will leave you with one HP. Yeah, these three niggas here. Caster, Ranger, Fighter. I wonder who they are. I'm gonna lock his shit off camera too. Let's see. Store. Store this. Store that. Reminder. Reminder is probably better.
Let's increase my armor. I've got new weapons of What do you want to upgrade? They mean to <laughs> they mean to do that, but you know, I don't know. You know what? What do I need? Queen R? How many I got? No. Let's just let's upgrade this. Got some clean steel. I can easily upgrade that to the fourth. But I'm up to about blood veil. You want to upgrade? I go here, let me see, dexterity D, mind D, willpower C, fortitude C. Ugh. What weapons can I use? I can use this with it. Put that there, get this now. Use it. Glow of Madness, increase power of the next attack. These can probably be stacked. I'm thinking. Why can I use these? I'm using a great sword. Probably got my, um, With Yakumo reduces guards mm, usage and dodge speed but increases attack. Ugh. Oh, that's horrible. But actually, I didn't get haste. Ugh. Uh, I'm just setting it up. I'm just setting it up. A little madness finishing. Oh, man. Alright, defense up. Blood guard. Do I want blood guard? I need blood guard in. So I need all the shit that I don't have currently. Currently maxed out but from his tree. Is that it? Is that everything? Mm, I could. I don't know. Fire or lightning? And they're interchangeable. No, actually, attack up. Alright, that's what I really want. Resilient focus. What else we got? Weather. What other? Okay, so guard drain rating up. Alright, I'm gonna get this. I want sprinter or stamina boost. I'm gonna go for sprinter. Boosting stamina is probably actually going to be better with the current weapon layout I got. So that's that's this layout. Now let's go back to this. Strength and dexterity. 
Nigga, what? Hold up. So I did... Where's strength and dexterity up at? Where's strength and dexterity up at? Defy parry, guard. Nigga, it's right there. It's right there. Hold it. Which one I want? Stamina boost? Fuck stamina boost. What's to put my shit at? Stats. S C D C A C. Alright, now. Can I use any of this shit? I can use blind or bind. I uh, use ranged impact. I don't care about that. Royal heart, temporary increased agony resistance. Mm 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 mm. Yes, let's, let's, let's keep it like that. Alright, now I'll go back to Prometheus. Because I want this unlocked. We're going to leave it here, guys. It's been an hour. I don't really mind this being an hour. I think this was dope. If you all enjoyed the episode, leave a like and comment. Subscribe to join Slick Block. SBM UWG is out. Oh, fuck. Peace.